everyone, it's Hunter and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, it is so nice to meet you. In today's video, I am going to be sharing with you guys my favorites for the month of August. August was a very busy but a really good month, so I thought I would just sit down and take a moment to share with you guys the things that I've been loving. I do a video like this at the end of every single month to kind of compile together a list, if you will, of of things that I haven't gotten to show you in other vlog style videos. So that's what we're doing today. I can't believe August is over but I'm ready for September and I like I said I'm just I'm super excited for September. I'm ready for the temperature to cool down a little bit. It's probably only gonna be like a degree a day but I'll take it. With that being said let's just go ahead and get on into the favorites. Since we just moved into our house about a month ago and I had my birthday I do have quite a handful of favorites that I genuinely do not see myself not using pretty much ever anytime for the, the near future. So the first things that I'm going to show you are going to be in other rooms. So let's go ahead and head on to my bathroom because that's where my first favorite is. So the first favorite I have is actually in my shower. So we am going to keep going into my shower. Also there are LEDs in here which is terrible for my camera. But so my first favorite are these baskets. I saw these on TikTok. Also sorry it's echoey. We're obviously in the shower. Um, These baskets. It came in a set of two, I think it may have been like $30, but it has this adhesive thing back here. So it attaches with a very, very, very strong adhesive backing and then you just snap it on. So if I were to move and need a new adhesive, I can just buy a new adhesive. Um, we tried something that we already had that had suction cups on it, but it just didn't want to stay. So we have of course our new things here. It's been so nice because I love the tile, um, but the suction cups again were not working. It came with these, ah, hold on. It came with these hooks. I put my hooks back here. So this is like a scalp scrubber. And then I have my regular body scrubber. And then there are two more. I put them right here in the front just for, they want this like up against the wall. But this is so nice, there's two of them. This one is slightly bigger than this one, but I love the silver because we have a silver, this is our shower head. We have a silver in everything. So I'm a big fan and I also like that I can, like this is my makeup eraser. It looks disgusting because I took my makeup off with it yesterday, but I like that I can kind of just put it right there, let it dry, and it can stay in the shower without being like all over my bathroom. So these are the first thing, I will link these down below because I'm fully obsessed with these. So now I have some more bathroom things, but they're not in the shower, so let's go to my vanity. Hi, okay, so do you see the stripes on the screen where it's like moving? the lines. I don't know. It's like moving. I can't see it very well anymore because I've been staring at it for so long. But if you see the stripes moving, it's because there are LED lights in here. But the next things that I've been loving are these products. They are ITK skincare from the Brooklyn and Bailey. Uh, they just came out with their new skincare line and I am obsessed. Um, I am a part of the, I don't know how to say this. I'm a part of the ITK crew, which means that I have tested products before they came out, so I've been using them a lot longer than they've been out to the public. Um, so I'm so excited to finally have the real products in my hands. Um, I think my favorite ones so far are these two. These are two that I actually did not get to test um, in the like testing phase. I got to test the Nightly Clarifying Serum, which I really loved. Um, but these two are my absolute favorite. It is the Blemish Treatment Mist. Here it is the Blemish Treatment Mist, and also the Prebiotic Gel Moisturizer. The moisturizer literally feels so good. It does not feel, um, it does not feel greasy. I like the gel texture to it, even though it's like a cream, if that makes sense, let me show it to you. It's like a cream, but it has like a gel consistency when you like rub it in, and I'm obsessed with the way it feels. It doesn't feel heavy. I have noticed my skin has been super oily recently, so I've been loving that. And then the Blemish Treatment Mist, is interesting because it has mint extract. So when you spray it on your face, it is minty feeling. Um, so I do cover up my eyes with it, but it has 2% salicylic acid and my skin has actually seen some improvements since I started using it. So big fan of those. And now there are a couple things in my bedroom I'd like to show you. So let's leave with the bathroom. So the two things, wow, it is amazingly not echoey in here. The two things I've been loving over here are these two things actually. So first, I got this for my birthday. It is a neck book light. It has three different color modes. 
um, and it has a light on both sides or you can just do one at a time and it's so nice because it's super super bright but you can also I like this is weird but I like put it inside the edge of my shirt so it dims it just a little bit because it is so bright but it works so well I have books right here on my nightstand that I've been reading at nighttime so that's why I have this just chilling right here because it's the best place for it but the next thing is another light and this is cool because you can change the position of it so you can have it facing whichever way you want so let me turn it on so it has three different settings so it's like brightness settings and then also has three different color settings just like the book light does but you can see where it changes but I like the this orangey one it looks a lot more orange on camera than it does in real life but this just gives me the right ambiance for bedtime but I like mine going this way but Mason like likes his going this way and depending on the time of day depends on when it, like so like it looks better here now but at nighttime I feel like it lights up here better but I like that it has all of this it's touch so and it's also battery powered and you charge it with a USB-C with a USB C cable and it's really nice because there's no cables or anything and this just ad uses adhesive to attach to the wall and the coolest part is that it comes off the wall so this is magnetic it's magnetic right here and it just attaches with a little ball so you can literally make it face however you want you can do whatever and it's seriously so fun it's so nice because you can just grab it if you need to go to the bathroom or something in the middle of the night and you need a flashlight don't feel like looking for your phone it's super awesome me and Mason both have one they were like $20 each on okay so the next place we're going is actually the office I should have shown you this first but I didn't um earlier in I think it was this month I posted a video of me building my new desk so let me just show it to you this is the Alex desk it's I don't know what this is called this um at Ikea is called but this is the Alex drawers there are two skinny drawers three like wider drawers it is the perfect width I think it's like 55 inches I think and then I have this monitorizer which is so nice it was like $35 from Ikea but I just love this whole set up and I love the desk. I like that there is so much room so I can push my chair under and there's just there's tons of storage here. I like how long it is and I like that I can put my main stuff over there and I can primarily like work over there but if I have like papers or anything that I need to work on over here um as well as just having decor over here. I'm obsessed with this desk so I wanted to share because. Okay so now we're gonna take a little trip downstairs to see a few more things. So this was on the hook by our friend door but it is this bell bag I got this for my birthday for my parents if you watched my birthday vlog you'll have seen it but it fits perfectly like this with it all the way done so if you are any bigger than me then it's probably not gonna fit like this um it might sit a little higher but I'm obsessed with like where this sits on me but it also fits perfectly around my waist if I wanted to wear it as like a waist belt bag but this color is beautiful it's like a what's the word I'm looking for like a dusty navy color this is I think the color that my bridesmaids dresses were when I got married, but it has this clip. I love how thick this strap is, and it has this pouch back here that perfectly fits my phone. So that's what I put in here whenever I use it, and I need my phone to be put away, especially if I'm wearing like a dress or something. The zipper is nice and smooth. It has a big mesh pouch in the middle. I mean, on this side, it has two smaller mesh pouches on this side, which is great for like cash and cards. And then there's a big pouch in the middle. I have some change in there, but also I have. That's where I keep my Kindle whenever I leave the house. Also, I'm obsessed with these um, Propel powder packets um, and I take my water bottle with me everywhere. I can't stand tap water. So I like to have these with me because if I fill up at someone else's house or if I'm in public or something, then I can have my yummy flavored water without worrying about the taste. Um, I don't care about, I don't feel like tap water is contaminated, at least not where I live. I just don't like the way it tastes. So there is that. I'm going to go ahead and put this in my change jar and then we'll move on to the next item. Okay. The next item is in my kitchen and I think you're going to be amazed. If you watched my video earlier this month about getting our new fridge, my new fridge is my favorite thing in the world. Let me move you a little closer so you can see it better. Um, if you, so here it is. It is the Samsung Bespoke and I know what you're thinking. White, white refrigerators look cheap, right? Right? That's where you're wrong. This is glass. So it's super, super, super easy to clean. You can use a regular window cleaner and it comes off so easily. Also, I wasn't sure if I was gonna like this color compared to our cabinets, but I think it looks amazing. We have stainless steel on our other appliances. So I didn't think I was gonna like the way the white looked with it, but I'm seriously in love. I love that there's no hardware on the front because you know, it just gives it a very sleek look. I also love that if I wanted to change the colors of these panels one day, I can, but let me show you my two favorite things about this fridge. Well, 
well, I already mentioned that I love that it doesn't have hardware, but it does have little handle spots at the top and at the bottom, so you can grab it from top or bottom. But the thing that's the coolest is they call this a beverage center. Um, in the more expensive model of this one, um, that one was not in stock. It was only like $100 more. Um, but in the more expensive version, they have a water refill station right here, and they have this thing here. Um, this one just has a, a basket, I guess, is what this is. But I'm a big fan of the space right here because we have juice in this section, but then it has a refillable water pitcher. So you see that this is full all the way. I'm gonna pour some of it out. Okay, you see it's like right here and then put it back in and then you close the fridge, you give it a minute and it refills on its own. So we constantly have fresh, cold and filtered water. So it's not just straight from the tap from the sink, which is my favorite thing. That was a really big thing that I, I don't know if you can hear it, but you can hear it refilling. That was a really big thing that was an absolute requirement for me when we bought our fridge was that it had to have something for water and it had to have an ice maker that was easily accessible. So I wasn't sure that I was going to like that this didn't have just the plain refill thing that you could just like stick your cup on. But here we are, refillable pitcher all the way filled up again. And it's just so nice because like I said, we always have fresh water and if we need to, like we can take it out if we need to. Um, and then it also has that filter basket so you can put like fruit and stuff to diffuse it. Now, my second favorite thing about this is the ice maker. So let me just adjust the camera seat. Okay, so this is not even the reason why we fully decided on this one, but I knew it had an ice maker, but I did not know that it made two kinds of ice. It's nice because it has this, so it's covered up when you're not using it, but it comes with a little scooper, which I know is stupid, but like it's so nice because you don't have to use your hands. And then you use this and push, you push it back right there. And there are two kinds of ice. There is this normal, um, just like big, cubes of ice, which is so nice. I'm gonna put this one in the sink so it doesn't get put back in there. But it also has small cubes, small cubes. And that's so fun. I love putting these in my coffee because it just makes it look so aesthetic. Like seriously, this is amazing and I'm obsessed with it. Oh, I'll put that in the sink too. But I love that it has two different kinds. I use this whenever I'm doing like a water bottle or a cup of water, but I use this for my coffee. So. I didn't think because there was a small that I would end up using the big ones, but I used both of them. And this is also super easy to pull out if I needed to like dump it, it has handles and stuff. Um, and then I just open that back up, put that in there and then close the fridge. And when you open it back up, it's covered again. Okay, so now that I have shared all of my favorites with you, I feel like this was the most adult kind of favorites video I've ever done because I have a massive appliance that literally cost $2,000. Um, also, very thankful to my in-laws. They were very, very generous and they paid for our fridge. So that's why we have such an amazing fridge. Now that I have just gone on and on and on, I have three minutes left on my SD card. I don't know how that's possible. But anyway, that's all I have for today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.